this is uh, seven IC seven to five. It has been uh, restored with uh, the power issue, and uh, right the receiver is working. But uh, there is a notice. Still there. I need to. I need to turn on the. I need to replace the two bulbs here. The intensity is. The screen is not. Uh, so I, this side is darker. So two bulbs are gone. So they currently right now would like to see the S meter is not functioning. So right now there is a noise, but the S meter is not is not at all showing any other. For the the tone, the S meter still stands still, almost uh, stands still. So right now I am taking the reference uh, from the ASU. Yes, so with the uh, noise, background noise, the band noise of fourteen one zero zero. Of course, if I go with the uh, seven megahertz, the band noise is still it's uh, zero. At least the band noise has to be five one five at this moment because I am checking with the. Other radio. So let me go back. Go. Let me go and check on twenty meter on the S. This okay. Meter fourteen one zero zero. I need to align. So at this moment, there is a noise, but there is no S meter function. So if I check it with the ASO at fourteen one zero zero, the band noise is approximately around five one three, roughly five one three. I just turned off the ADC. So, similarly, if I check on 20 meter, sorry, 10 meter, uh, 7, 40 meter, forty meter on the LSB, still it is five and three. So if I check forty meter on this, on this icon, there is a noise there, but the S meter is. See so right now the S meter at this for twenty meter, sorry at forty meter on the SU. The noise is around five and five now. But there is here. Let me come to seven zero zero. The noise there, but the S meter no function. Here the noise there. S meter is around five and five. At this moment, the noise band noise. If I change to other bands, of course, band uh, higher band by the noise is lesser. Let me reduce the volume. See on the 18 me 18 megahertz. See on 17 meter the band noise is 
almost nil but if i come to lower band 20 meter 53 40 meter around 515 so this way i am going for the uh, the, the simple uh, simple alignment of the simple method of uh, aligning the s meter i am not sure how much it is uh, uh, it works but i am trying to the reference because i don't have right now at this moment the 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 signal generator so that if i i can inject and then align it that's a procedure as per the manual uh, but i am trying go i am going for the noise level at this moment or otherwise i will uh, later on go for the 70 of the tone on uh, 10 megahertz uh, uh, or 15 megahertz so both the receivers are working fine the only thing is s meter is the issue so let me open and i just check the manual and uh, need to look for the the potentiometer of the uh, r110 and 116 i will show you the um, reference from the service manual so let me proceed the icom 725 service manual at the page 27 you can see the receiver alignment procedure under this if we look at this s meter this s meter alignment the s meter alignment this column belongs to the procedure this is alignment procedure measurement and the values and the adjustment point and uh, the unit locations so at s meter so display frequency should be 114100 at the usb preamplifier switch off set the gen signal generator a level at 50 micro volts that is uh, minus 73 dbm and uh, modulation is off so so with this uh, information we have to proceed with the uh, tuning of the um, the presets which is these are the settings at the front panel and the meter so for the s9 and uh, s960 db so the location is on the main board and the adjustment term points are uh, r116 this we need to align uh, for the s9 uh, with this uh, with this uh, uh, input uh, from the signal generator so we need to tune r11 for the s9 or uh, ts meter and uh, s9 6 plus 60 db we need to set by aligning this uh, uh, variable resistance that is r110 so this way we can perfectly calibrate the res meter for the 59 and 59 plus 60 db so this input in this input is really necessary so right now i just checked it based on the band noise I just uh, removed the back cover. I removed the back cover. Uh, this this is R one one zero and one one six. Let me turn on the receiver.
let me turn Turning the one one six, I turn a bit around the clockwise. Yes, meter increased. And it is fluctuating from the standing still. So I just turned a bit. Lot of difference. Good screws intact. Let us check again. Powering it on. See the S meter deflection. DC first is enabled. Let me disable. Okay, so let's switch off. Now the ADC, ADC is slow. Let me just make it fast. ADC fast. Thank you very much. Hope the relatively the S meter is uh, functioning better than the earlier. Of course, this is not the correct method. We need to have a uh, calibration with the the signal generator. I need to follow the procedure as per the service manual of the S meter alignment. So we'll do it further on, uh, further uh, when I get the signal generator. Thanks a lot. Thank you very much uh, for watching.